I got your juicy entertainment news for Wednesday. Police in Haiti have a Florida doctor in custody and have identified a man who they say is the mastermind of President Jovenel Moise's assassination, uh, who was the mastermind behind President Jovenel Moise's assassination, and uh, said that he wanted to steal the presidency for himself and had hired the killers as his bodyguards. Um, President Jovenel Moise was shot dead in his bedroom in Port-au-Prince last Wednesday, and the police in Haiti said that 28 people carried out the attack, and that as of Monday, 21 people had been arrested in connection with it. Police now have in custody Christian Emmanuel Sanon, who is a 63-year-old Haitian-born man who worked as a doctor in Florida. Police say that he flew to Haiti on a private jet in early June with political objectives. Um, and some of the men involved in the assassination had actually flown over with him on the private jet. After a search of Sanon's home in Haiti, the police found a hat with the logo of the U.S. Drug Enforcement Administration, 20 boxes of bullets, gun parts, four license plates from the Dominican Republic, and two cars. Uh, two Haitian Americans were also arrested in the connection with the killing, and they told authorities that the group's intention was not to kill Moise, but to arrest him and take him to the presidential palace, and that they'd have had an arrest warrant for Moise, but he was dead by the time they arrived. Hmm. Um, Haiti has asked the U.S. to send troops to help stabilize the country, in the, and the U.S. is now analyzing whether or not to do so. Senior officials from the FBI and Department of Homeland Security have arrived in Haiti. They did so on Sunday to discuss how the U.S. can help. Um, Moving forward into more entertainment news, the romance between Kanye and supermodel Arena Shake appear to have been extremely short-lived. That was not her, by the way, sitting on the side of him and the f picture that you saw of him wearing the bubble jacket and the full-faced mask at Paris Fashion Week. No. According to reports, the rumored couple is already cooling it off and uh, Irina is not interested in dating Kanye. Apparently... Kanye had asked her to join him in Paris for Fashion Week, but she turned him down because she said she doesn't want people thinking that they are an item. She likes him as a friend. She doesn't want a relationship. Um, and she doesn't want the association that they are dating, which is what it would have run in the press if she had showed up in Paris with him. And that would have been a whole month of news saying the two of them are dating. Um, she was The two of them, of course, were first spotted together in Provence, um, Provence, rather, France, uh, for Kanye's birthday last month, but sources claim that she only attended as his friend. There were 50 other people there, um, and uh, Irina explained that she doesn't want to be linked with anyone right now. She's happy being single. And um, something I noticed in that photo that they showed of Kanye, he's still wearing his wedding ring. And that's your Juicy Entertainment News for Wednesday. Locking in again tomorrow for more of the juice right here on the all-new KISS 96.